Welcome everyone to a Pokemon Sword video. I am back after a very long time of not posting any Pokemon Sword content. Um, I'm trying to find something here. Uh, oh yeah, Isle of Armor. That reminds me, if you are watching this video and you want me to skip, and you want me to skip right to Isle of Armor. And like, don't do the rest of this and just skip right to Isle of Armor because I can't. I have another account. Uh, comment down below because then I'll do it if I get get enough. If I get over five, I will. Um, that's the intro. I'm back again. Roll intro. Man, I love that intro. Every time, I just it just gets me. So we left off right here this time. Uh, yeah, let's go. Mr. Chairman. Uh, I've been collecting both the wishing stars and gym badges as fast as I can. Good for you, bed. <laughs> right. Um, good work, bed. I'm glad you haven't forgotten that it is the chairman who endorsed you. If I've gathered enough wishing stars, that'll help solve the problem. That's been bothering you, right, Mr. Chairman? Oh, it's not just about me. It's for the future of whole of the whole Galar region. And we'll need more than just wishing stars. We'll need a powerful Pokemon trainer too. Someone like the champion. With all due respect, sir, I was able to show Hop, one of the champion endorsed players, just how outclassed he was. I'm sure I'll be able to defeat the champion. No, I will defeat the champion. Um, I mean, strong words right there. That's the spirit. It takes healthy competition. Let me, can I just uh, do this real quick? Sorry for this. Um, that's the spirit. It takes healthy competition to really keep a gym challenge energized. Challenger Bead. Uh, his real name's Bead. I like calling him Bed though. There's something I wish to discuss with you. Do you have a moment? Chairman's like, oh John, how you do? Hope you are listening, John. As you know, wishing stars are the most mysterious stones out of that are even attached to Dynamax bands. There's more wishing stars than just making your Pokemon into giants, though. They hold far more energy than that. If you're curious, you should head to the stadium, in fact. Uh, we should head inside right away. I'll even give you a little lesson on how to Galar region get this energy. Man, the chairman really goes casual. <laughs> All right. Oh, and uh, I forgot to say, at 30 subscribers, 30 subscribers, I am going to do a 30 subscriber special, so make sure to like and subscribe. Um, I'm actually going to be doing a Bean Boozled game with my sister. Yeah, and it's going to be real cool. Hammerlock Stadium doubles as an energy plant. Now have a look at my tablet. I've got all the information you need on it. Ooh, that's a nice tablet. See an easy to understand description of the energy plant. First, energy absorbed from the Hammerlock Stadium's tower, then changed into electricity in the underground power plant and delivered to people throughout the region. Our lives in society require various types of energy sources such as electricity and natural gas. And water. Huh. My associate groups aim to improve everyone's lives by harnessing the power stored in wishing stars. Oh, it's time for me to get to work. I should get a move on before Arlena decides to give me another earful. John, suggest you head over to the vault next. Head toward Route 6 from the stadium. 
and you should find the vault without any issues. Route six. Uh, I know where the vault is. Yep. Yeah, it's to the left. Uh, yeah, Sonia's there too. Sonia's there. She's gonna tell you all about stuff and junk. About the sword and shield Pokemon. John! It seems you're doing well collecting gem badges. But Hop, did something happen with him? He's acting really odd when I ran into him. He took one look at me that immediately says, immediately was like, I'm so sorry, Lee. It might be the first time I've heard him apologize for anything. <laughs> My. And I have no idea what it was for. Yeah, this is the point in the game where Hop starts getting depressed. Maybe he's feeling down because he had some hard losses in battle. He lost to that challenger bed boy. When you lose to feel down in the dumps, but there's somewhere left to get back up. You've got to think on why it was you lost though. Makes no sense. You know that little brother of mine, I think he might become a surprisingly great trainer. Blast and look at the time. I nearly forgot meeting with the chairman that Orlina really lets me hear it when I'm late. Now if now if only I could remember which way to go. Anyways, I'd say that you go and say hello to Ryan while you're here, John. He's the greatest rival I've ever got and the final hurdle you'll have to face him in the gym challenge. He should still be around the vault. If you hurry it's down that way on the way to Route Six. All right. Um, if I'm correct, I think you challenge Railhan in the vault. So the vault's right over here. Yep, right here. There he is. Oh, if it isn't the trainer endorsed by the champion. Uh, let's see, what was your name again? Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> He's looking at me up. Hey, I'm on the internet. I'm on the internet. And if Leon himself recognized your potential, I guess you'll grow up to be quite the trainer. Oh, yeah. Cowboy. All the same, though, anyone waiting to challenge the mighty red hand has to prove they're up to it by earning seven gym badges first. He changed from Western to British how he is. I already knew that. I'm a British boy. Ah, oh, so you're here to see our treasures, aren't you? Gaining a better understanding of Pokemon by stunning- <laughs> I'm not doing voices anymore. Sorry, guys. But I'm still gonna do a voice for myself. The rare occasions I talk, though. Um, gaining a better understanding of Pokemon by studying history certainly isn't a bad idea. I like your spirit, kid. Follow me, why don't you? Who is this? Oh, Ray. Ray Ihan? Or like Rayhan? 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 I don't know. I'll even spare you one of my lead cards. Cool, I got a weed card. Put the lead card in your album. On you go. If it's the vault you want, it's up those stairs there. Cool, so much dialogue in this game. All right, uh, all right. Okay, there we go. The vault doesn't have any treasures in it, it just has paintings. Oh, you're here. Brilliant, aren't they? It's great that there's still treasured tapestries that can tell us of Galar's history. The two youths watching a wishing star. The disaster occurs. The two bewildered youths. The youths looking at the sword and shield that stop the disaster. The youths being crowned. So it was just two normal boys. Then the boys... Got the thorn shield when the 
when the darkest day came. And then the Boaz won the darkest day and became kings. Say, Young Jim Challenger, what sticks out to you most about them? There's two heroes for the darkest day. Um, The darkest day has always been weird, so I guess I'm going to say that. Right, that got to be it. The story of the black storm that blotted out the skies were, was passed through the years as a tale of disaster. That's what the darkest day is. Was there really only one hero? Or were there two? What even caused the darkest day? Alright, here. Big announcement. I am hereby canceling the Fire Emblem series. If you liked that series, make sure to let me know down in the comments. Um, then maybe I'll keep it there if enough people like it. But if I don't, I'm canceling it, making room for more Pokemon content. And then um, I Love Armor. And then Zelda. Zelda is coming up because I got 50 views on that one video. I have a busy schedule, don't we? Um, yeah, so be prepared for that. Comment if you want Fire Emblem to stay. Thanks for letting me bounce some ideas off you. I think I've got some theories now. But that's just a theory. A Pokemon theory. And thanks for watching. I'm going to research the tapestries a tad more, but you have your gym challenge, right? I'm cheering for you. So take a couple of these. Hope you see more of your wins. We oh, got some revives. Alright, so what now? No, just walk away like okay bye okay bye all right so do i just go to the next gym now because i think the next one's the fighting gym well you know he's still here uh yeah the good Modern hero, blah, listen up, the blah, 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 go, blah, 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 still on side, blah, blah, blah. Yep, so I have to go get the next gym now. Uh, I want a Pokemon good on HP. Ooh, I'm gonna do some heals real quick. Um, potion, that should be enough. Good. Um, I think my Pokemon average levels to around 26, probably 26.5, probably just 26 though. Yep, so it's the fighting type gym. Which I remember having some hard times with the fighting type gym. It's a cute silicobra. Just look at those adorable eyes. It's our duty as Tim Meal to make sure Silicobra gets a nice painful sleep. Oh hello there. If I promise not to wake the Pokemon, will you let me through? I'll leave a like if that's a good old grandma voice. Of course, it'll be our pleasure. Hop. Hey, oh, hey, John. You're heading to Stone Side, right? Oi, Tim, yo. Don't suppose you let us through. Nah, you kids are way too loud. Can't be letting you through. On, um, we're particularly not fond of kids wearing the challenge band. With all your stomping around, Celicobra is sure to wake up. Right. What do you say, John? If we don't get past them, we, we won't be able to continue our gym on solar side. I'll battle them. You, yeah, that's the spirit. You two are way too noisy. You don't want to wake up Silicobra now, don't you? I swear, kids these days. Well, we've got no choice. We'll have to send you packing. It's all for the sake of Silicobra. It's kind of funny because it makes no sense. Oh, so it's just, is it just me battling him? Stunky. Uh, Rabu, beat him up. 
Ooh, I'm level 28. Mm -mm. I might be under level here. I might need to do some grinding. Oh, I almost one-shot the boy, though. Poison gas. Does nothing. Other than poison me, I guess. Uh, flame charge again. Faint? Oh, it does damage. Boom, get attacked. Aftermath, oh. That's one of those Pokemon that deal damage if you kill it. Hey, Corkskyre. And Scumfish. And Rabu. And Noctowl. That was a big battle for my team. Oh, let's switch out. I don't want... Um, I don't want anyone to die here. So I'm going to send out Noctowl. My boy Noctowl. He's real good. Noctowl is actually my favorite Pokemon. <laughs> Level 30, my. I'm going to have to do some grinding. Baby doll eyes. How does that Pokemon have baby doll eyes? It's not even cute. Boom, that does like nothing here. Um, uh, I'm gonna switch. I'm gonna switch out. Ooh, Rabu has a super effective move. Oh, uh, so does Scunfisk. Um, send out Scunfisk. Scunfisk doesn't have the uh, baby doll eyes effect on him. Slice. The uh, raises its attack, I'm pretty sure. And then its accuracy. Yeah, it's a pretty. Revenge. So, way back in the mine, got the pickaxe wing and side to side. This task a grueling one. Hope to find some diamonds tonight. The rabbit woke up. Total shrunk feels your body. God, baby, tonight. So, do I have to fight the other one now? I thought we were gonna fight it, Hop. Oh, well, I guess Hop is a big wimp. Rabu, come on, let's do it. Let's go, let's go. I uh, don't want Rabu to die. Just do double kick. What is that? Oh, flinched. I flinched. Don't die. Don't die, Rabu. Don't die. Okay. Bag. Uh. This won't full heal him, but... Well, actually, it will. It does 120. We know it, it won't. No! You just push me. Then I'm poisoned? Oh, my. Do I have a poison heal? Wait, no. Burn heal and paralyze heal, but no... Poison heal. Yep, just heal. Just heal up. Heal up. Alright, that didn't do much. I'm just in the yellow. Does this Pokemon just grow hands? <gasps> One damage. Oh, one HP. Oh, my. Yep, then. Yep, but now, since he died, I can pull out Skunfisk and do Revenge. It does so much damage. It's a super effective, and it does more since Rabu just died. That's insane how much damage it's going to do. Most likely going to kill it right here. If it survives this move, which looks like it will. Just accuracy. Look at this. It's just gonna. Well, did less than I thought, but I still got him. Good night, Lipard. 
Oh yeah. Oh darn it. Oh, I needed to revive. I should do some max raids. Get the candy. Will it heal me up? Will it heal me up? Please heal me up. Well, you're just saying like, I hate losing. It's kind of like pulling an Ash Ketchum. Basically jumping off a building after he loses. Oh, it's like, I'm just bad. I am so bad that Pokemon. Only got that CP5 Pokemon. It runs off crying. Oh, Silicobra, how you doing, mate? Bye, Silicobra. I might have to catch some stronger Pokemon here, too. You're one of the... Oh, it's this girl, Opal. The 50-year-old who's still rocking as a gym trainer. Probably older than 50, probably like 70-year-old. Oh, have a look at my league card. Oh, cool. Opal, you league card. Oh yes, old oh, lady. Oh, now then that walk makes you think she's 90 years old. She's still killing it as a Pokemon trainer. It's kind of a plot point that she is so old. So. Oh, I almost walked right into that person's beam. Without healing up my Pokemon first. Alright, uh, where's the revives here? Get the revive. Get the super potion. Squirt, squirt. Get the normal potion. On Skunfisk. Alright. We're ready to fight this person. Let's go. Here, let's challenge her. Beauty Anita. All right, Rabbit, let's go. Your fire type Pokemon, the sun shouldn't do much on you. Tick tock. Oh. oh. Wait, I think that's an attack that chooses randomly from any attack out of the entire Pokemon skill set. Like the in like every single Raboot fell in love. That makes no sense. I just killed her. Hey Scunfist, nice. Cliff Fable. I'll keep, I'll keep. Is it the same Pokemon? Nope. It's just stronger. one level stronger and the higher evolution metronome again is that all it knows poison gas yeah it it chooses a random move out of every single move in this game well clefable definitely a harder opponent but still beatable my speed is just going to be off the charts at the end of this battle. Minimize. Oh, that lowers my accuracy. Inevidence? What is that even? I don't even know what that does. I'm just going to finish it off with double kick. Oh, I think it... Yeah, because it's technically smaller. Multi attack. What is this Pokemon? And it's gonna finish me off with poison. Wonderful. Alright, so I'm gonna send out Skunfisk. And since I want Raboot to level up, I'm gonna get give Raboot the revive the revive the revive 
chest I she's like when she tells the metronome she's like oh Cliff Abel you just got a metronome support I've never even seen that move before he's asleep my gosh sucker punch just get him get him get him Waterfall. I'm a water type Pokemon. Let's just do revenge. Like, no, no, no. Outrage. That does nothing again. You think if you got beat up this much, yeah, you would wake up. Revenge. So way back in the mind, got that big, I can think of that, do that, do that. Alright, nice. Got the Elam. Get the Vic Roy. Uh, Raboot leveled up, nice. I uh, forget old move. Take down, 90 damage. Replace it with tackle. Yep, my team's getting better. No, most players kind of stick with a type. No, I'm all over the place. All right. It restores its own AP. The amount of HP regained varies with the weather. What do you mean? Like if it's snowing outside? I kind of like the Pokemon skill set right now. I'll have to pass on that one. Rabu wants to learn headbutt. Let's forget no move. Let's replace it with quick attack. It does the exact same amount of damage, it just has more accuracy. <laughs> Yay, headbutt. <gasps> oh, I lose. You're not bad at Pokemon Go. I know we're not playing Pokemon Go. Let's uh, catch a yum mask. That's nice. I'll get him a yum mask. A wild yum mask. Go, Rabu. Let's get it. Alright, so this is level 30 of mask. I'm just gonna do a flame charge, get it down a little bit. Perfect. Wandering spirit, switch it up here. That doesn't do very much. I mean, oh yeah, I forgot it switches every time. It's a weird Pokemon move, but Pokeball. Uh, more friendly towards you. Lure Ball, Dusk Balls, Pokeball. I don't use Pokeball. I'm gonna use Heal Balls. I need to get more Pokeballs. <laughs> what? Not even a shake? Not even a shake. Yeah, I can no longer run anymore. Just use a heal ball again. Eh? 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 Yes! Got a mask. Who should I switch it out with, guys? Yo mask. Um, nope. Add to my party. Let's. Who should we swap, guys? Uh, I want to keep Eldegrass. She's high level. I want to keep Core Squire. Uh, should I do Shelios? Mm. Or Stunfisk? He was Stunfisk was coming in clutch the last couple games, so I'm gonna switch out Shelios. Stunfisk earned his spot in the team roster. All right, a fishing spot, random but okay. Oh, pull it. 
<laughs> a magic carp. It's a magic carp. <laughs> a level 29 magic carp. I wonder if I can just first try this thing with the heal ball. Um, did you hear what that magic carp sounded like? Nothing happened. It's completely useless. I'm not gonna get magic carp. <laughs> I guess if you want a Gyarados, you're just gonna have to keep the magic carp on your team and just let it heal up. Or like just get to the XP. Just feeding off the XP. Cause why else would you get a magic carp that literally does nothing? Oh, two fighters. The medical group. Another fighter. This place is littered with fighters. Or challengers, I should say. Oh, that's the Pokemon Fossil Girl. Right, I should actually be fighting these guys. Yeah, I should actually be fighting them. Yep, yeah, I'm gonna do a little bit of grinding here. Um, you don't have to watch this if you don't. If you don't want to. You could skip through this. I'm just gonna grind for a little bit. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Alright, we're fighting a uh, backpacker. Um, I believe I challenged backpacker, Dane. Sock? Oh yeah, I forgot you can get sock in this game. You cannot get throw, though, for some reason, but you can get sock. It's weird, but... Yep, you can get sock. And sock is a sock. Owie, no fair. We're not playing karate, sock. We're doing elemental attacks, not physical attacks. Sock. Don't die, don't die. Mmm, after. I'm really mainly doing this because of Rabu. Mm, I'm wanting Rabu to, uh,. Swap Pokemon. I'm wanting Rabbit to evolve into a Railaboom. Nah. Rabbit. Into a. R I actually forgot. Cinderace. Cinderace. My, my. Cinderace. Bulk up. I remember in the Pokemon Black and White TV show. I think it was black and white. There's this girl, and she was, like, in love with Sock. And, like, every time he used the move Bulk Up, it, like, shows an intense cinematic scene of him, like, legitimately getting buffer. <laughs> and she would just swoon every time. I... What? That did, like, nothing. Hex? Let's try this. I think it's... I think it burns you. Yeah, he's just charging up. Oh, because his defense raises too. That's why I did nothing. Well, I got him anyways. GG. Ooh, Stunfisk. Wait, did you just speak the Spanish? Did you not have this on Spanish version? I wonder what would happen if I had it on the Spanish version. <laughs> would it be English? I wonder. So what I'm actually going to do... You know, I'm just going to heal up Rabu every time. Yeah, I'm going to stop at the store, buy some stuff. I'm just going to waste all my heals. Oh, yep, yeah, it's a duo battle. Duo squads. I'll be playing some solo duos or duos no fill. Playing some duos no fill. I'm 
3128. Ooh, that might not be good. Um, Togetic. I'm going to go against Togetic here. And then Echoed Voice. Or Extra Sensory. That move is scary. It seems like fire type moves do good against these time type of Pokemon. Wait, it doesn't affect Pinward? Of course it doesn't affect Pinward. Ancient power, who are you using that on? So this time let's do flame charge on Pinward and then extra sensory on Togetic. Oh my gosh, that's just one shot at Pinward. My goodness. I just went. Boom, right on Pinward. That reminds me of just like a fever dream. If you're dreaming of, you know, a owl. Boom, Togetic has to die here. Yep, Togetic's dead. GG. Ooh, the triple level up. Quag Sky or Scary Face? I'm gonna keep all move, thank you very much. Boom, beat you. Beat you. Give me all that money. Give me all money, money. Give me that money, money. How long will it take to freaking level up Rabu? What level does she even... Seriously, one HP. What level does... I keep calling her she, but it's actually he. What level does he evolve? I'm not sure. Questions for the universe. I'll have to look it up sometime. Go up the ladder. <laughs> my, my. All right, I'm actually too far. I'm in like a little secret area, I think. Fossilized dino. Two fossilized dino. Can I combine just plain two? Can I just... Oh, so I can't do the same one. Never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind, never mind. Never mind, I can't do the same top and the same bottom. I'll have to, like, get a fish bottom or, like, something else bottom. I know where to get one, too. I might do it some episode. I just need to maneuver my way through here. Hello, fellow Pokemon trainer. Um, there's pe there's a, someone down here that's mandatory. Who is this guy? What does he look like? Wait, is he holding a sculpture? He's probably gonna be like artist Jonathan or something. Dukin or Duncan? Duncan. Man, he's real passionate. What's that Pokemon? What's that Pokemon he he holding? What that Pokemon he holding there? I see what that Pokemon he holding there. I don't know, it looks like a Pikachu. Every Pokemon's a Pikachu. Whoa, self destruct? <laughs> wow. Yep, I hope the neutralizing gas wore not. <laughs> Swoodo Wudo. Oh, he's a wood type, right? I'm keeping current Pokemon. It makes sense for him to have a Swoodo Wudo. It's the imitation Pokemon. He can be like a uh like a mannequin for him. To like draw. Swoodo Wudo is literally not moving, other than blinking. Oh my goodness. Uh 
Thank you very much for that, Sudo Udo. I didn't know you can actually do rock type moves. Um, let's do um, let's, let's, let's do Elder Grass. I guess we can do Elder Grass. Pull out Elder Grass. Uh, Elder Grass, do sing, make him go bread. Go bread, go bread, go bread. Freaking gonna one shot. Oh, thank goodness, not actually a one shot there. <laughs> Alright, so let's start going baby boy, I'm just gonna revive, go ahead and give Ramu the revive, and just, uh, give Elmagross the chance to actually get the kill. If she survives this moment here, congratulations, um, I will heal you, um, it's a really bad Donald Trump impression, I don't even know if I'm doing it good, I'm just talking like how anyone should talk. In a Pokemon battle. Ha! Elder Grass avoided the attack. Leaf. Tornado. Cotton. Spore. Magical. Leaf. Sing. Leaf. Tornado. Swoodo Wudo probably avoided the attack. Swoodo Wudo, even though he's like T posing the whole time, still avoids every attack that you might even do to this person. Cotton. Spore. I bet Swoodo Wudo. Wait, Swoodo Wudo actually does not avoid the attack, ladies and gentlemen. Swoodo Wudo actually takes the whatever that move was. Will Elder Grass die here? Elder Grass does take the L here, sadly. Poor Elder Grass. I'm gonna have to pull out Noctowl with the 99 HP so close to the 100 HP bomb. Um, I will use the move Peck to hopefully do damage. To Sweeto Wudo. Yes, it does damage to Sweeto Wudo, but basically nothing. Noctowl gets one shot by the Sweeto Wudo. Sadly, we might lose the battle against a freaking Sweeto Wudo. Um, next I'm gonna pull out the Stunfisk. Hopefully, his revenge move can do the extra damage that we need to pull out the clutch here. This all depends on Stunfisk's revenge. Will we be able to do this? Yes, it looks like we will be able to do this. And it does a lot of damage here. And Swoodawoodo is going with the Sucker Punch once again, but Stunfisk is going with the Revenge to hopefully finish off Swoodawoodo, and he finishes him off. A tough one there for John, but makes it out alive somehow. Pulls out the clutch against Arnest Duncan. Stunfisk is really pulling out nice games here, playing with John and communicating real well with the rest of the team. Um, oh come on, do I have to talk to anybody? Nice and peaceful. Reminds me of the Gerudo, Gerudo Town. That's like the same music type too. Anyways, I'm healing up. Yes. I like to heal up real quick. Bloop, 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 bum, 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 bum. Perfect acapella right there. Um, nice. Alright. Alright, I can now purchase more stuff now. I'm here to buy. Thank you very much. Uh, can I buy, um... I cannot buy Mega Potions, but I can indeed buy, um, Pokeballs. I'm gonna buy 30 Pokeballs. And I'm gonna buy the rest of my money in Super Potions. You know, just for the heals. Thank you. I might actually want to sell some stuff. I have some good items here I can sell. Um, but ugh. no, I don't. Big pearl, fossilized dino star piece. I'm gonna go with the very big sale of the big pearl. Ranking in. You know what I just realized? This game is too big for my TV to like actually hold. My my money's getting cut off. Yep, J.K. I'm not gonna sell you no more. Alright, so I'm all healed up now. 
Goodbye, Pokemon store. Um, I'm heading on to go most likely fail over here at the gym challenge. But first, probably fighting against Hop. I'm still not too sure what I should do about all the stuff I told you before. About me being weak and dragging down fleet. Good name, Noel. Yeah? I can't do the Australian down under Australian. But the only thing I can do is get stronger, right? So I'm going to try all kinds of different things against you and see what works. Wait a minute. Okay, you're on. Never mind. Oh my gosh, Hop. Why would you get that Pokemon? <laughs> Honestly. Alright, flame charge. Clutch up here in the flame charge. They did like nothing to Cameron. Um, let's see how this pulls out Camerant with the, um, what is this move, like, multi-needle? Um, he's just gonna do that every time. Rabu is switching to the double kick. Let's see if this does any more damage. It does not do any more damage. Rabu might have someone that could stop him right here. Camerant with the pluck, doing critical damage, getting him down to the yellow. Raboot trying a different move once again. Swift. Once again, there's barely nothing but getting Camerant down to the yellow. Raboot with the 4 HP. John going with the switch. But what is he going to switch to is the question. It appears that he's going to be switching to Eldegrass. Smart move. He has the type advantage over this Pokemon. Fury attack. Like this video if you think Elder Gross is a big brain. Fury attack once again. How many hits will he get? Three, three times. You sing. The move was not successful. He's going to be pulling off a leaf tornado. Let's see if it. Let's see if it, um, oh, he hides underwater. It doesn't look like there's any water there. <laughs> I'm gonna do a, uh, like a move to dodge it. Is there, like, any counter for, like, dig or fly or dive? Wait, did he catch a Pikachu? Weird Easter eggs. Wait, did he throw a Pikachu at me? <laughs> What is this Pokemon? Alright, I'm sorry. I'm breaking character. What in the world is that Pokemon? Super effective damage. Oh, you think you're all that, don't you, Hop? Huh? Don't ya? Well, you're really not, because I'm about to kill your Pokemon. You completely commit manslaughter on all four of your Pokemon. Mmm, okay. Uh, let's do this move. I don't even know if it's gonna do anything. It's probably not. One. Not two. Not three. Not three. But <laughs> four still. Oh my, that does major damage to Camerant. Camerant fainted. What Pokemon will hop a pull out of his pocket next? Rabu levels up. Same as your mask. He's about to pull out Thwacky. I will keep current Pokemon. Trainer Hop sent out Thwacky. Thwacky with the level 33. I'm going to be getting the super effective with Peck for Rum. Uh, whatever. Knocked Owl. Knocked Owl uses Peck. With a super effective on Thwacky. Hop's all right. Mm hmm. Yeah. So Thwacky probably once again is going for the really weak move round. It's really stupid, but yet it kills me a lot. I don't know why. Does it like do good if it's like going to kill the person? Well like kill the person if the move will kill the person. It makes oh, that should be a Pokemon move. What is it gonna be like Leaf Wind? 
I was going for the kill here with Rage Relief. Um, since I had Thwacky as my main, or like not my main, but my starter in the whole Thwacky line, um, I know Thwacky and like what he does. So he's gonna go for the round again, yeah. I would have done Razor Leaf again just for the final punch right on um, Knocked Owl. Thwacky in the critical damage range. What will Knocked Owl do? He will go to the bag and then heal up. A oh, weird move for um, Trainer John to do, but yet it'll probably help him out in the end. Wacky was trying to squeech, screech, but his vocal cords failed him. Razor Leaf again going for the high damage finishes here. Not very effective. Knocked out while using extra swordinary and getting the kill on Thwacky. Um, I am predicting that John will bring out his um, Wooloo next to counter the knockout, Knocked Owl and counter um, forget an old move. Is this Gunfisk? This is Gunfisk. Um, Mudshot. I might have to switch it out with Mudshot. Because Mudshot doesn't really do much damage. And especially in this next gym coming up, it won't do much. Gunfisk learned Iron Defense. Toxel. Oh, he's sending out Toxel. Let's keep our current Pokemon to just wreck his Toxel. How we feeling all upbeat here, this level 29 Toxel coming in, trying to get the clutch, but not really. I've never actually went against a Toxel, alone. I'm doing laps around my room, hoping I'm not gonna lose. Whoa, one shot the Toxel. Toxel's freaking weak with the one shot. Next he's going to be pulling out his Wulu to come finish the job, if he can even finish the job, because Wulu. Wait, Silla Cobra, he lost the Wulu? What? is going on here, ladies and gentlemen. Is it breakfast? Is it just ditching Wooloo somehow? I don't know, but we're doing this move again. It's been doing us real clutch lately. Um, that was the real critical damage. Oh, you're getting hit now. Mm-mm, not today, brother, because I'm going to hit you right back. Right there, hopefully with a critical hit and barely has any HP left. Brutal swing, will this finish him off? No, it will not, and it looks like Trainer John will pull out with the clutch here today. Extra Centauri, getting the kill right here on Silicobra. All right, thanks for watching everyone. Um, that's gonna be it for today's video. Um, thanks for watching. Um, I'm gonna be tackling the gym, whatever the gym, the gym, just the gym, the gym challenger. All right, and uh, he's like, oh, I said I lost, but I'm gonna get stronger. Beat you one day, bye bye. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. Oh, that child looks like Opal's here. Um, thanks for watching, guys. Um, I'm gonna leave it right here on this cliffhanger. That child, who knows what Opal's gonna say? Probably do. If you already play the game, would I already play the game? Or I don't know. So, thanks for watching, everyone. See you next time. Oh wait, Jim Challenge should battle for the sake of their own Pokemon. I guess so. But see you next time. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day. What day is it today? It's Saturday. Um, yeah. Uh, comment down below if you want me to skip right to Isle of Armor, or if you want to. If you want um, Fire Emblem to stay, see you next time, guys. Um, catch you on the flip-flop.